What's up, reading people? How's it going? So today we're going to do another book tag, another book tag, another book tag. So in honor of me starting the amazing and awesome Lady Midnight by Cassandra Clare. This thing is a beast, by the way. Oh, I gotta show you guys. I did not know when I bought this book that it was signed. I didn't know. So that was a nice fun surprise when I opened this book. There's a beautiful little signature on it. It's very excited. So in honor of me starting that book, today we are going to do the Nephelum tag. Now this tag was created by Johnny Reeds and I will attach the original video down below so feel free to go check that out. So question number one, the mortal instruments or the infernal devices? This isn't even a like competition for me. Infernal devices at all times. Two, your favorite male character. Will Harrendale. Duh. Duh. It's Will frickin' Harrendale. Number three, your favorite female character. See, this one is a tough one for me because I can think with all the female characters, I can think of something that I'm like, no, nah, that kind of kills it for me. It's definitely not Clary because Clary drives me up a wall. I think my favorite would have to be Izzy. I really, like, I enjoy Emma. Like, I just started Dark Artifices, so, like, I'm, I... I think Emma's gonna end up being my favorite, but for now I gotta say Izzy because Jocelyn drives me nuts. I don't think anybody's gonna pick Maris. I love Izzy because she's very independent and she is her own character in her own person without really needing somebody else to rescue her. And she really stays true to that throughout the entire Mortal Instruments series. Number four is your favorite ship. I believe this is a tie between Wessa, which is Will and Tessa, and Malik. Cause I love me some Magnus and Alec in the melodrama that is those two together. They're mm, the melodrama. I think I'm gonna have to go with Wessa though. Cause just that push and pull throughout the entire Infernal Devices just right in the soul and it hurts. Number five, your least favorite ship. Jocelyn and Luke. I don't even know if they have a name. If they have, I've never heard of it because I don't care enough. Number six, what kind of downworlder would you be? I would like to think that I would be a warlock because that would be awesome. Number seven, your favorite book. My favorite book is Clockwork Princess. I love this one, it hurts so bad. Number eight, what Shadowhunter family would you belong in? There's the part of me that is- I'd be a Herondale. I'd be top of the line. I'd be Shadowhunter royalty. But then there's like the more realistic part that I'm family frou-frou down on the bottom that nobody's ever heard of before because they're so unimportant. I think if I was gonna be in a family, I'd want to be in the Carstairs family. Just because I love that last name and the way it sounds. Carstairs. Carstairs. I would want to be a car stairs. I don't know if I would belong as a car stairs, but I would want to be one. Number nine, what would be your ideal weapon? I gotta go for a street Alec Lightwood in the bow and arrow. I think the bow and arrow is so cool. I love the precision. So like bow and arrow throwing knives, like just the precision weapons. Number 10, how did you get into Cassandra Clare's books? I honestly have no idea. So my reading people, that is the Nephelum tag. If you have not done this tag, then you are absolutely tagged to do it. I was not tagged by anybody. I just wanted to honor the fact that I'm starting Lady Midnight. If you want to stay up to date on my progress with Lady Midnight and all my thoughts and feels as I start reading away. All of my social links are down below. I post videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. As always, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, and I will see you next time.